See, as a child, everything was within reach. Easy, it all made sense. There were no limitations, no career seemed far fetched to absurd. You could be anything you dreamed of. So I, I wanted to be a fairy. No, no, not the tooth fairy. See, losing my teeth was painful enough in a world where the sky was glittery blue and the ground, while the ground was just as glittery but green, I wanted to be the kind of fairy that helped others. The kind that simply used magic not to turn people into toads or do anything crazy. The kind that simply used magic to brighten up people's days and put a smile on everybody's face. In my world, there was no room for sadness or despair. I was the fairy godmother that made sure everybody was joyful and everything fair. See, at times though, at times I had a little fun. Changed the colour of my hair, painted hearts in the sky and I made it rain Cadbury because I love chocolate so why not? But you see, as I grew older things began to change. I became more aware of my surroundings and the society we live in. It was so different, so different that at times I was convinced I had travelled to a new world, a world that was full of surprises and not always the good kind. It was a world that put in place all these standards, expecting everyone to abide by them and if you daringly chose to stray from these standards, you were given names, stereotypes, made to feel out of place and confused See, this world. This world was hard to navigate. Even with a detailed map in hand, you couldn't help but find yourself lost in its clutches. This world, this world was different. Having a dream wasn't enough to pursue a career. You had to sweat, struggle, and even at times lose part of yourself. This world, this world was cruel. It dangled hopes and wishes right before your eyes, only to yank them away just as you reached out to grab them. But despite all its misery and struggles, this world, this world was the best of teachers. Its cruel ways and rough demeanor built you into a human that could not be broken. Having to constantly find your way around barriers, you learned to love taking your long route to your destination for you, found all these great treasures along the way. After constantly being rejected, you learned to love your mistakes. You saw the beauty each area contained and the perfection that came about from restarting and thinking things over after constantly being crushed and abused for so long. You had developed a layer of skin so thick you were invincible. But what helped in a world as crazy and unpredictable as this one was the support and love of friends and family that helped pick you up and dust you off when you were down. Friends and family that reassured you, had faith and uplifted you when you were headed in the right direction. But you see, strangers, even strangers play a vital role. In a world where strangers have faith, where people trust that you will do your job, a world where people extend their hand out to you when you ask for help, where people fight with you when you face injustice. This, this is the reason why I still have hope. That hey, if these people are here, why can't I exist and do my part in making this world a better place? It's a times like that, where I glimpse a little of the magic that I used to be fond of as a child, and I grasp it tightly, hoping that it will grow into a magic powerful enough to heal the whole world.